So don't mind if I kind of look like a little hot mess because I was just out running errands for hours and hours and hours and I had a meeting this morning and I just touched up a little bit, but this zit will not conceal, no matter how I try. So don't mind the redness just staring at you, okay? Just ignore it like it's not even there. So get ready, because this is going to be really out of order and really random in a lot of different places, but let's get going. CVS. I've been really into trying these masks lately, so I got a peel off one. Seems kind of interesting. Anti-stress. You know, I could use tons of that. And I may have featured this in a haul before. The strawberry one that I recently got. Well, now I got the coconut one. I'm just so in love with these. Crud. Um, lastly was a wide purple Revlon brush, which is in the bathroom, but here's the proof. Staples! I got these for free. These pens were free, and I probably shouldn't even be showing you because this should be in my school supplies haul. But, uh, seven black pens. They were $4 with a $4 rebate. Boom! Free. And then I saw this when I was gonna check out, and I just had to get it. It's a to-do list with do it now section and do it later section and little check marks. This is just so perfect for me and will save room in my planner and it's just awesomeness. And it was only a dollar. Walmart! I still have my other Maybelline eye pencil, which is uh, the iStudio something or other that I reviewed. I'll put the review link in the description box so you can check it out. But I've been really wanting to try this because a lot of people just love it. So, I got this Definer Brow Eyebrow Pencil in Light Blonde. It says it's best for light to dark blondes, so it should work for me. Then, to Wet n Wild, things I've been wanting to try forever, this blush in pearlescent pink. Do I see a NARS orgasm dupe? I think I may. Looks very similar. I don't know. How about you? Finally, the Walking on Eggshells Eyeshadow Trio, my favorite makeup guru, Emily Noel83, talks about this all the time. And um, I finally want to get it. It's just so perfect. It's your go-to natural look. And the eyelid color actually looks kind of similar to Naked Lunch by MAC. Which, ironically, I have on my lid today, but it looks kind of greasy now for some reason. And I don't know why. But there's the two of them together. Don't they look so similar? Oh, I may have found a dupe. Oh, I'm so excited. Michaels, I got these things right here. So I got these things at Michaels. Um... It's a carving knife set. I found this in, like, the section with wood making supplies and all that. Um, they also had them similar ones in the craft section, but they were a couple dollars more. Basically, I got these because I was in hunt for a spatula to use in my makeup train case as well as for the Revlon, like, whipped foundation. This is the closest I found. A couple of them are like curved so I could get the foundation easily and cut so I can cut lipsticks. But it's not really what I'm looking for. If anybody on here knows where I can get just one of those metal silver spatulas, you know, individual, please let me know. I've checked Sally's, Michael's, Cosmoprof, a lot of different places and I can't find them. Piercing Pagoda. This one really isn't interesting. It's just some of the ear care solution <laughs> because um, I use this to clean my earrings. Cosmopra! You may or may not have one near you, and you may or may not be able to go in there. Um, it is only for licensed or certified beauty professionals, so hairdressers, makeup artists, estheticians, um, nail artists, all those kind of things. Um, I don't know why I don't go there more, <laughs> because I'm so excited about the finds. Um, my OPI nail block was getting really dull, so I wanted to get another, but they don't have any more, so she pointing me to Star Pro Miracle Buff and Shine Block. I just hope it's as good, because I really like my OPI one. I got another OPI start to finish base coat, top coat, and nail strengthener. This is all I ever use anymore. This is the first ever nail polish I've actually repurchased ever. So I was pretty excited about this. And my best finds ever. I got China Glaze Radiant. Radiant. Right there. Because if you're familiar with my uh, like first manicure experience video when I got acrylic nails, this was the exact nail polish that I used at the salon for the little stripe. Uh, if you're not familiar, that link will be in the description as well. But um, it was on sale for like three something and I was like, yes, I'm getting it because it has the most pretty, awesome silver and color sparkles. 
I got two colors from the Fall 2012 OPI Collection Germany. Um, this collection literally just came out, and so I was really happy they were in stock. <sighs> Let me tell you the advantages to being a professional. These OPI nail polishes were $4.25 each, when they are usually $8.50 each everywhere. So that means I got two for the price of one, and I was so excited. I, I, I'm serious, like, whenever I want OPI nail polishes, that's all I'm, that's the only place I'm ever going from now on, and China Glaze. They're so much better than Sally's anywhere. I saw on a blog all the colors and swatches, and I was like, okay, I have to have those two colors. So this really vibrant, pretty violet purple, it's called Susie and the Seven Dusseldorfs, Dusseldorfs, maybe? I don't know. And then this awesome burnt orange. This just looks super cool on nails, and I just can't wait. This is schnapps out of it. Well, that was Cosmoprof, and I was so excited to get really good deals on those nail polishes. And for the first time ever, repurchase a nail polish. Target! Last but certainly not least, I got the August 2012 issue of People Style Watch because I had a coupon for $1 off. So basically instead of $3.99, it was $2.99. And then I got this 13 pocket expanding coupon file. Um, this was like $5 and change, so I was like, bummer. Even the plastic ones were ridiculous amounts because I could have sworn I just saw a back to school video where they were $1 at Target. No, they weren't. They were like five, six, seven dollars for those stupid plastic ones, and I was like, oh, well, I might as well get the sturdier one. This is purposely for coupons. Um, so actually, right now, I'm putting coupons and receipts in here. I put the receipts in the front. Um, coupons I'm planning on using soon in the second one, and then in the back, either coupons that don't expire or um, coupons that I may or may not use. I'm going to organize it a little more and a little better, but if anyone has good tips or knows of videos, do a video response or comment below because I'm actually really getting into couponing, so if anyone has awesome tips for me, please let me know. Or if you know of a place that you can actually use several manufacturer coupons at once, please tell me because I have four different simple skincare coupons. But Target said you can only use one manufacturer and one Target coupon at a time. So I was like, oh, bummer, because I could get a really good deal um, if I could use all four together. So please let me know if you know somewhere, anywhere that does it. But that is it. That's my super awesome collective haul. Um, very random and awesome. But um, I will be doing a back to school haul very, 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 very soon because I know by the time this video is getting posted that it's very close to back to school time. I start back at college August 29th on Wednesday, so um, that will definitely be posted really, really soon because um, I pre-record videos, so I'm not really sure when this is going to go up, but I promise that my back to school haul will be up very shortly. Thanks so much for watching, as always. Um, when I get to 500 subscribers, I'm having another giveaway, so be sure to stay subscribed and, you know, like my videos and everything because um, I really enjoy making them for you guys, and I enjoy when you enjoy them. So, that's about it. Um, that's the haul. I'll see you in my next video. Thanks for watching, and have an awesome, awesome day. Bye!